In round 18, start with one chain stitch, then work a sack up three single crochets, one decrease for four times. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Then work three single crochets and one decrease this one set. Work three single crochets. Then work one decrease. Work three single crochets and one decrease is one set. Please finish the rest three sets by yourself. Four sets are done. Work one slip stitch in the first stitch. Round 18 is done. Stress the loop and remove the hook. Tear the fiber fill to make it fluffy. And then stuff the fabric with fiber fill. Please finish these steps by yourself. This should be what it looks like when it's done. We'll continue crocheting. Put the hook back into the loop and tighten the loop. In round 19, start with one chain stitch, then work a sack up, one single crochet, one decrease, one single crochet for four times. Finally, end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Then work one single crochet, one decrease, and one single crochet as one set. One single crochet. One decrease. One single crochet. Work one single crochet, one decrease, and one single crochet as one set. Please finish the rest three sets by yourself. Four sets are done. Work one slip stitch in the first stitch. Round 19 is done.
in round 20, start with one chain stitch, then work 6 decreases, finally end with one slip stitch. Work one chain stitch first. Then work 6 decreases. Finally, work one slip stitch. Round 20 is done. Break yarn, leave it a yarn tail. And put a yarn tail out. Thread the needle with the yarn tail. So hold close by stitching through the front loops only of the last round. Pull the yarn tail tight to close the ring. Conceal the yarn tail inside the fabric. And finally cut off excess end. The head is completed. Please crochet one more head with the corresponding yarn in the same way.